Hello everyone, welcome back to another installment of Let's Play Assassin's Creed Origins. Uh, when we last left off, we had just begun uh, tentatively exploring the Canopus Gnome. Uh, I think the last thing, the very last thing we did was synchronize a viewpoint. Um, we are meeting up with Apollodorus uh, next, our uh, main contact for this uh, part of the game. Uh, before I begin, just a um, couple of housekeeping notes. Um, I'm switching up my schedule a little bit. Instead of Tuesdays and Thursdays at 7 o'clock, I'm fr um, from now on going to stream uh, Mondays and Wednesdays from 7 o'clock in the evening. So I haven't yet updated the Twitch schedule, but uh, I'll do that as soon as I'm done here. All right, let's get back into it. Enjoying a cup of coffee. <laughs> All right, uh, let's just see here. Uh, Egypt's Magi, that's the main quest, we will hold off on that a little bit. Let's do some of the side content in this area first. And let's uh, first cause some mayhem. They didn't notice. All right, let's see where this. Uh, okay, this uh, daily quest isn't too far. Let's just go do this real quick. Reach and clear the bandit camp. So this is a daily quest from uh, Reda. Uh, I won't usually bother to do this. Um, oh yeah, I remember now. I did one of them uh, in a previous stream just to show you what happens. You get basically. A loot box giving you a, either a um, legendary or rare either weapon or shield or outfit. Anyway, let's just do this. Right, this was just a quick little detour. Nothing to it. Back to Redda we go. Let's just avoid that camp. I don't feel like fighting those guys. I thought I heard some pings. You know me, if it isn't nailed to the ground, I will uh, loot it. I think that's just, uh, yeah, that's just arrows. No need for that. I have six sleeping darts, all right, moving up in the world. The max is 13, so we're almost halfway there. Not bad. I really do feel handicapped without uh, <laughs> all my equipment and so on un unlocked. You never cease to impress by Oh, not bad. We got a legendary sickle sword. Song of the Desert. Uh, 
Yeah, my Sun Slayer is level 18. This is also level 18. Instant charging? Nah. I don't think I have the charge ability unlocked yet, do I? No, I don't. So at least for now I'll stick with the Sun Slayer. I do anyway prefer um, swords, regular swords, to all the other weapons in the game. I mean, every other weapon has its use. I mean, it's I guess it's uh, a little bit up to preference, but I I like the swords. Ooh. What did he have? Iron. Not bad. Now where were we? We were doing the um, blue hall, blue hooligans quest. Did we read this? Yeah, we are uh, off to seek to uh, to seek to save um, one of the um, boys uh, who was abducted by bandits, if I recall correctly. Anyway, let's uh, go find them. And I do believe there's also a papyrus to do around here, if I have it. Uh, no, this is not it. No. No, alright, we don't have that papyrus yet. <coughs> Excuse me. Oh, I keep forgetting I have to be precise with the Sidhu. There are five enemies and I have six sleeping darts. Can I get them all to sleep without being detected? Oh. Uh, he woke up. And I'm out of sleeping darts. Hey, wait. Think I can still do this? Oh, hello. Wait a second. Ah, how in the world was I not detected? Blind luck. Quiet, quiet. I'm here to get you back to your mother. Filthy Prasina Greens. I swear, Ankh Tifi, if I hear one more of these Prasina Greens chant and mourn the death of their precious Icarus, I'll beat one to death. Anyway, I'm leaving some of our hard-earned winnings at the small hideout. This race-rigging scam is really starting to pay off. All right. Time to go home. Wait, Medzai. The psychic cock stole a bust of Icarus that my mother had prepared for the great Sariotir's memorial. They threw it in the river to defile it and bring a curse upon the Prasina green racers. We need it. Let me get you to your mother first. No. You must retrieve it before it is lost for good, or else my mother will never recover from her despair. I can make it home. I am too weak to find the bust. Please, find the bust of my namesake and bring it back to my mother. As I must. As you must. As one does. Helping people in need. After all, that's uh, supposed to be a Magi's job. He is a protector of the people, after all. Let's go get that bust. A small statuette bearing the likeness of Icarus, the chariot driver. So he was kind of a big deal. 
So to be completely honest, um, this catapult gnome, these side quests in this part of the game, I don't really care for. It's not that interesting. At least not compared to the other things happening in the game. But this is a completionist run, so we gotta do what we gotta do. I mean, the I can I can enjoy intrigue, but um, these feuds between rival and um, charioteer uh, teams, uh, yeah, I don't <laughs> care for it. <laughs> Right, let's go refill our ammunition and return the bust of Icarus to uh, Celine, I believe the mother's name is. Prasina has a chance in the upcoming games. You are truly a blessing sent from the gods. We will make an offering to Icarus and the Prasina Green in your name. There is no need for that. But if you must, make the offering for my son. I would have loved to have shown him the spectacle of the Hippodrome. We will. Come, mother. We have to prepare to deal with my brother's funeral. Yes, of course. At least he's glad that the bust of Icarus was restored. Like, I think one of the reasons I don't particularly enjoy uh, this, um, this quest chain is because it's like there are two teams, the Prasina Greens and the, uh, the, is that the one called? Blue... Yeah, I forget, but anyway, we, we don't have a stake in this. We could just as, just as easily have been recruited by the other team. So, yeah. I think it's a little bit boring. Anyway, yeah, now we have... Um, ah, now we can attempt uh, this quest, Wrath of the Poets in Alexandria. What do you say? Let's give it a try. And then we can also clear out uh, this location, the Accra garrison. And then maybe we can also do, do this higher education quest. I'm level 18, almost 19, yeah. Let's see if we can clear out the entirety of Alexandria. That would be nice. As you can see, I like playing methodically. Clearing out one area at a time. Now, I really do like playing games um, in completionist style, you know, um, getting, uh, as, as I see it, getting my uh, money's worth when I pay for a game, I like to really play it. Uh, but I realized that for my first playthrough, uh, doing uh, a Ubisoft game uh, might not have been the best idea. They're known to be very long and a bit bloated at times. but. Uh, yeah, we'll see how it goes. I've been thinking also about maybe streaming some other games in between. Maybe doing a blind playthrough of a game. I mean, this game I know inside out, so... Uh, this place is guarded. It's fairly easy for me to play completionist. Oh. Oh, hello. Where are you? So the guards in this area are fairly low level, but I think the guards which chase you eventually, they're like level 20 or whatever it was. Ah, too slow. Come on. I need to work on my parry uh, timing. <laughs> It's horrendous. Oh, I want to get him, get him in the air. That way he can potentially take fall damage on the 
impromptu stuff. In any case, did we clear this area? No, we didn't. So let's mark some enemies and uh, treasure on the, uh, on the heads of display. Let's uh, release these prisoners. They, they can run around and aggro enemies for us. Now, where are the stairs down to this wealth of treasure? Ah, no matter. I'll just go in the secret, so to speak, entrance, which isn't all that secret. Report 122 to Fulakitai. A boat was seen leaving the palace last night, through the canal. The great Apollodorus was in the boat, so we didn't ask for credentials. There was a woman next to him. She dressed richly and was likely a noble. We protected his passage through the canal until he reached safety. <coughs> now that is uh, most likely Cleopatra, don't you think? Yeah, I guess these entrances aren't really called secret, they're more like uh, alternative entries. Let's make sure to loot absolutely everything. Now, I don't know if I really care too much about s being completely stealthy, uh, sneaking around at least until I've become, uh, or until I've unlocked um, more abilities and um, Sinus perception is a bit better. It just takes too long to go through and uh, uh, mark every enemy. But we'll see, I can try to play a little bit stealthily at least. And uh, I don't have any more sleeping darts, so I should top them off somewhere. Hang on. Uh, maybe I can get him. Release these prisoners. Oh, that one was open. And you go ahead and cause some uh, mayhem. Oh, and I completely, uh, <laughs> completely wasted all my, um, all my sleeping darts. And I should be using this ball. Now, did I set a trap on the... Um... On the brazier? I don't remember. I don't think I did. Oh. Thought maybe I could assassinate them. Hey, come here. Come back, you. Uh, 
And upstairs here there is a ladder. Feel like it I order one to one. We must maintain maintain two guards on the ballista at all times, surveying the canal. Send patrols five times a day to inspect the canal. No one is to exit the palace without an escort or clearance. Even Her Highness is not allowed to leave the palace. little too far away. Wait a minute. Now you wait a minute. Wait right there. I'll just loot downstairs and be with you momentarily. What's the matter? What you doing? Yeah, so I think the higher level enemies, they spawn when I release um, the actor <clears throat> in the cage. So I will wait a bit. I will, however, release these guys. Let's check out the, this uh, main building. Philakitai order 250. We're looking for an armed woman. She is very dangerous, and she murdered the noble Acteon. Take some men and go look in all the sewers near, near the Jewish district. She is probably hiding there. Don't hesitate to kill her if she resists. So that, of course, would be referring to Aya. And look at that. We leveled up. Let's see what all we can get. I do eventually want this, but this is no uh, priority. <clears throat> I do want the overpowered chain throw. I could also get this. This is useful to um, uh, bash away the big tower shield guys. But um, I do have the smoke bomb damage, which knocks them to the ground anyway, so I have a pretty solid way to deal with them, so I don't need that uh, yet. Do I really want to wait two more ability points for this? And uh, three more to get Elite Ranger? I don't know. Flesh Decay is actually useful. No, I want this. I'll wait for two more uh, ability points. 
Can't even look an actor in the face. I'll immortalize you in color. If you get me out. You got yourself a deal. Hey, careful there, big guy. Ah, carry to safety. An experience like no other. Will you be still? Thank you enough, friend. Ah. here i need to get out of this place yeah 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 patience my friend thank you but there are two more of us they escaped canadios filakitai seek to kill them they also took the play and headed toward the palace if it lands in the wrong hands thanos will be in danger do you know where the actors hide they're home not far from here don't worry about me, I'll find my way back to the theater. Alright, find and recover the script and rescue the rest of the actors. <clears throat> Should be easy, we hope. Alright, so this was the uh, script called The Politics of the Gods. Thanos' play definitely calls out the regime. Getting this back into his hands will help him produce his vision, though it never does explain why the gods need lawyers or why they're so interested in the Ptolemies. Interesting observation. Relevant today as well, I guess. As maybe in uh, every time in human history. Oh, for some reason I really want to zip line down there. Can I jump to it? I can. And I uh, didn't even get any fall damage. Yeah, so if you don't know, um, or I mean, if, if you played uh, some of the earlier games, you know uh, about the mechanic called Catch Late Ledge which allows um, the protagonist to reach his hand out to find a handhold to grab while in the in midair. There is also a grab ledge in this game, but it's not animated. But you can actually grab, uh, well, I guess not 360 degrees, but 180 um, in, in front of you. So you can grab um, handholds in front of you and to your sides, basically. It's just not animated. Which is a shame, if you ask me. Catch Ledge was a really useful ability in the earlier games. Time to go, young poet. Wait. Isn't there supposed to be two of you? Catarios? He fled and accidentally brought the guards to me. They hunt me like a dog. If you could deal with them, I can return to Phanos and our masterpiece will go on. Be calm. You will be out of here. All right, let's see if we can mark some of the guards that are searching for him. At least I think he's being hunted. Ah, maybe they spawn when we go outside. Where is that treasonous fool? You know, you are perfectly Thanos Town. You will find that fool now. Sir, I believe he's an actor. I don't care what he is. We must find him or I'll be stuck marking stables for weeks. I have no idea what you speak of. What? <laughs> First they talk in their sleep and then Bayek comments about something. Probably meant to be... Um... A grand story until the gods smack him down mightily for his temerity. That is not helpful. But such a tragedy is will be. All will be Oops. pushed to tears. But such a tragedy. Did not see him.
Come down here. Oh, he's level 20. Oh, okay. I gotta be a bit careful here. Ah, but regular soldiers just one level above you. It's not too dangerous unless there's a bunch of them. In which case they gang up on you and you don't stand a chance. Now there is nothing that will stop us from exposing this regime. Thank you, friend. I'm sure Capanios will find us eventually. He always does. When the danger is past, of course. Right, return to Fenos, but first I want to get that uh, treasure over there. Alright, back to Fenos we go. Let's see what he has to say. I never doubted you. Aya is a lucky woman. Yeah. Aya always spoke highly of your place. She enjoyed my pro Cleopatra work. My pharaoh lady. Now we can perform this play like true poets. The guards may kill us, but it is an artist's duty to see his vision fulfilled. <laughs> I will write a play for you someday, Bayek. The last of the Magi. <laughs> oh, no, 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 no. Don't worry. We'll change the names of the main villain, Ptolemy, and the title. We won't die, and the play will go on. Now, see, it's in moments like this that I uh, really wish I was more into history. I'm sure there's a story it's to all that. Choice, not orders that we defend our Pliad and our city. Your censorship causes no love for the people. We will win. I mean, it's probably just an easy Google search, just uh, or I mean, Wikipedia search. What will you do? What to will find you out uh, what Thanos the feel? Younger was about. We marvel at Gaul. We dare to risk neck and speak alone against Tomery. Against Tomery, that would be Ptolemy. <laughs> yeah, so this is probably uh, Cleopatra, right? And this would be Ptolemy, I guess. Or just a random person. That might be an idea. Maybe I should read up about uh, these kind of events so I have something to comment on before the stream. Anyway, uh, oh yeah, there's a new side quest here. Symposiasts. Level 21. We can probably do this. Now, did we actually clear out every location in Alexandria? I think we actually did. Didn't we? Yeah. And there are some uh, boats roaming around here. I might get this one. As long as it stays in the uh, Lake Mariotis area. I want a different outfit. Desert Cobra. This is a cool one. Thanks again for your help. Those Metrocoites will think twice before attacking my poets again. 
we will be able to spread our word and stomp out those filthy untruths, Payet. The regime will fear you, Fanos. They do already. Why do you think my poets are accosted in the street? Truly. Gennadios is Philakitai haunt the streets harassing our people. They grow even more vicious. This must stop. I will defend your poets. I support the cause. Of course, but first we celebrate. Then we destroy our opposition. Bye. It is finally time to celebrate with my muses. Shouldn't you stay to oversee your actors? We must find time to work on the next play. Bayek, you must come. This celebration better rival my own events in Siwa. Right. Symposiasts. Thanos wants to celebrate the successful launch of his newest play. Promises Bayek a night he won't soon forget. With the play a success, Thanos invites Bayek to his home to celebrate and plan the next steps in their plan to unite the, mas the masses. <clears throat> this will be an excellent night. Let us hurry. You will be our guest of honor. I remember the celebrations we would have in my house in the better years. Ah, memories. They have become less so of late. These feel lucky I suffocate our celebrations. They know nothing of poets. They think they know truth. You know it better. Of course. Truth comes from chaos, not order. I think he took a detour around the entire uh, library. Very good AI. <laughs> Stealing a random horse just to ride it for 10 meters. <laughs> Yeah, see the guards just roaming the streets are like level 8 and these are level 20, uh, 21. This could get dangerous, but... Uh, come back here, you have... Uh, oh, thanks Thanos. Cedarwood. Oh, hello there. I can see that perhaps I left some details out of her stories. Oh, look at this. A house of pleasure. 
Your plays are getting better in age. They are well improved from your previous works. Ever the creeping. Thank you, Leda. You must pick only one. You are more lovely than any of the muses, Ariadne. Hail! Hail the great poet! Now this is a bowl of wine I can get into. My wife thinks about my mistress house. Shows you what she knows. <laughs> this is the right kind of lotus. And this is it, where the poets of Alexandria find respite. Wait. Do you hear that? Gennadios! His men must have come after us. We will deal with this, Fanos. Come, bring your blade. I will fill my inkwells with the blood of these Metrocoitas. They come, Boye! Let the gods indulge! Gennadios sends his regards, Fanos. <laughs> Yeah, see, just one hit, uh, and I'm pretty fucked. Oh. Just loot all these fools. I think that's it. Good. Are your people safe, Panos? Metrocoites. They have slayed some of my muses. Dracon, my favorite poet, will live, thankfully. There must be a way to stop them permanently. Bayek, we are blood poets now. This is our chance to bring people to our cause. Whatever it takes to defend freedom. Give me some time. I will talk to my people. Find their strongholds. Yeah, I will have to remember to uh, mark this video as uh, containing nudity. Alright, where are we going now? Now we can probably do this side quest, even though it's level 21, we are level 19 still, but I think that'll be okay. Alright, onwards. You will be the death of me. No, mother. I will be your salvation. No more olives, no more payment to rent a press. Pay attention to what you have in front of you, idiot boy. Not the mirage you see in the distance. But what a mirage, mother. The white linens of a philosopher. And with that, drachmas. Coins would come from the papyrus you lost. Are you sure this is where you lost it? I already told you. The papyrus was taken from me. Just admit that you lost it! It was taken from me, mother. Do not fret. I'll get it back. I only need a small bit of help. Hmm, I wonder who will help you. Remember Tafibi, the wannabe philosopher? Magi, your help is needed again. My idiot son left my offering in his papyrus, which he lost. I cannot sell my oil without giving thanks. 
I did not lose it. The guards took it. The Papyrus is my life, Magi. They go too far, these guards. The Papyrus had my notes. Those bastards threw it on a boat. I will look into this, Tefibi. And I will find your offering, little mother. So, higher education. The guards stole Tefibi's notes, which also included his mother's offering to the gods. Tefibi asks Bayek's help in retrieving them. Tefibi has gotten into trouble again and has lost his precious papyrus, which also included an offering by his mother, Chepu. The papyrus was stolen by guards who he knows are patrolling on a felucca in the waters south of Alexandria. Find and recover the papyrus. Yeah, let's go My after we speak to Chepu. The Barrow's guards have yet to forget Tefibi's actions. I will find this better path, Magi. Never fear. Okay, okay, let's go grab ourselves a boat. And let's go find the Phoebus Papyrus. Now let's actually try to burn the Feluca down. Putting our arrows on fire. And, uh, well, not like that. Let's try that one more time. Better. Get back on dry lad, you idiot. This, this is the papyrus. And the offering. Both the Phoebe and Jepu will be happy. All right, what did we get? These are Tephibi's precious notes. Chepu's offering is folded amongst them. Let's get back. And once we're done with this side quest, I guess we are... Oops, there's a crocodile. Saw him a little bit too late. Maybe I should kill him. Level 8. And I do need crafting materials. Backing up, backing up. Let's go fight him mano a mano. Not a problem. Crocodiles are pretty dangerous, but not when they're, uh, what is it, 11 levels below yourself. What do you have? Oh, this is a civilian boat. Okay. Oh, I feel like you should be able to make that jump, don't you? That was ridiculous. And I can't even climb up these uh, slippery, like, algae-filled walls. <laughs> In reality, that would be impossible. But we don't play video games because they're realistic, do we? Now I'll prove to them that I can match them in wits. Still spouting your nonsense. The Greeks will never accept you. Yes, they will. I'll be a philosopher soon. Your offering. Now you can return to selling your olive oil. I worry about him forever. 
It is hard to understand when you do not have children. Allow the baby his chance. He'll be all right. Philakitai in the eye, side quest level 22. We might be able to do this. Oh, and there's a tr trireme out here we haven't. Uh... Oh, but I think they just wander uh, between the uh, agency and uh, the port of Alexandria. Now, actually, what level is this area? Oh, it's not level gated. Cool. Then we might do this area. Maybe. We'll see. Uh, the two, uh, these two northern areas, the agency. Uh, oh, I misremembered. Of course, yeah, the Mesogea Sea and the Great Green Sea. Those are. Uh, there are absolutely no quests which send you there. I think. Um, so they're free to explore. I guess. There are a few locations to complete, a few tri-rims. Um, I wonder what level the guards are. Maybe they're always scaled to your level. I don't rem re remember. And also stop to no good again. The warrior poet, you might say. Bayek, just the magi I was looking for. We know how to rid ourselves of Gennadios' Philakitai. You have found the Nekatiades. Indeed. One group patrols the waters, another sits in wait in the armory, seizing whoever they wish. The final man proclaims loudly against us in a chariot along the Canopic Way. Once rid of them, your poets can spread their good word throughout the entire city. We will deal with these Falakitai. Bayek seeks to end Thanos' fight with Gennadios' Falakitai one last time. After Gennadios' Falakitai attacked Thanos and his guests at his home during a celebration of the play, the artists of Alexandria were incensed. Thanos sent Bayek to deal with those who dared attack them. And we have to find and kill the charioteer, the soldiers, and we have to attack the armory. Well then, let's get to it. What's up first? Oh, hold on. Let's go... Uh, Deal with the charioteer. I must read Alexandria of these horrible beings. Death to all who spout treason. Those are to be punished immediately. I say we can put them to sleep, but they'll then wake up pretty soon afterwards. First defenders will have their hands taken. Yeah, so three levels ab above us isn't too bad, we just have to be careful. Yeah, so I just took one hit and more than half my health bar dis disappeared. So let's take advantage of every tool we have, especially the uh, smoke bombs. <coughs> Excuse me. These are Gennadios Falakitai. Down by the 
Now I think there are much... Oh, there's a guard. Oh, he's just level 21. Let's get him. Oh. I thought he was knocked to the ground as well. He was probably just a little bit outside the uh, area of effect. Oh yeah, I remember I have a level 20 sword. Which we will equip right after we uh, reach level uh, 20. Which is very soon. Uh, that's not to draw attention here. Okay, let's play it a little bit smarter this time. This must be the armory Fanos told me of. We're down one man. The orders are to recruit him. Stay behind me, Gideon. <laughs> Now we get one more hit on this guy, that's excellent. And the camera does its wonky thing. Oh, that's right, they don't stay do uh, down for too long. I just need to really keep them down. There we go. Let's plan our next move. Yeah, those two might be the last guys, on that guy. And that guy, and that guy. And now my smoke bombs are, are uh, all empty. I need to fill them up. Oh, and there's a lot of things we didn't loot here. Ah, I remember now, we just snuck in and got the uh, treasure. That's it. Captain's log. The sturdiness of our triremes made us proud and kept the pirates' ships at bay. Many of them were sunk. The Cypriot... Cy Cypriot or Cypriot? I think it's pronounced Cypriot. The Cypriot Cypress timber we have used to build our ships is the strongest. But we are not provided as regularly with it since Cicero's son became ruler. At least we still have large reserves to build more ships if needed. Right, so let's loot this place this place out. Should just be one more guy to deal with. But we'll keep on our toes. If not. Ah, and that's a big guy. Is there really no arrow rack here? Hmm. How many smoke bombs do we have? Zero. We have fire bombs. Hmm. Okay, this might actually present the problem. <laughs> hmm. Yeah, I have uh, the Feluca to deal with as well. I might, I might as well uh, run back and refill. Hold there! 
<laughs> Not a chance. <laughs> All right, the animation played, but I think he's taking the, taken out of the game. Oh, there he is, dead at least. Ooh, that was so close. Let's deal with the uh, last guy in the armory. Should we go berserk with these guys? Yeah, I think as long as I don't waste any uh, any of my tools. Ah, these are weak guys. Yeah, the trick is to just never give them a chance to fight back. I play dirty, I'm an assassin. Sue me. Harder or a, a bigger drop than I anticipated. Okay, okay. Now which way are they going? They're going away. They're taking the canal. Maybe I should just follow them through the canal. Say Fuluka when you need one. Ah, it's a bit far to swim, isn't it? I wonder, is it faster to shimmy like this than swimming? What do you think? Is this fast? I don't think think so. <laughs> Ooh, a little alcohol. Be seen in this area. I actually don't think I've ever been down here be before. There is actually stuff down here. Cool. Yeah, I think I've just beaten these guys outside of the canal every time. Ah, 
Oh, that was a little bit of a waste, I think. This is kind of cool. There's stuff to explore. Hmm. How in all my countless playthroughs of this game have I missed this area? Ooh. There's an entrance out by this way also. I think the Feluca is coming back through the canals. <laughs> Let's try to intercept them with um, the Predator bow. Can I equip another one? No, I need the... I need the skill... I could get it now actually. By this route. But I don't really want the charged heavy attack how much is this this is also one this is also an ability i don't care for so i sh should get it through this route i want this i want this do i want this yes i do want that actually but i do want the uh, second uh, bow now hmm yeah i'll do this one arrow retriever no! Ah, I thought I had two ability points. Damn it. I need to learn to count. Anyway. And I only have... Oh yeah, I sold... Ah, oh, damn it, I sold off all my predator bows as well. Or I mean everything below rare quality. Which means I didn't have any rare quality uh, predator bows yet. Oh well. The light bow it is then. Ah oh, shit. I probably am a little dead. I could fight them on land but um, with the bow it's gonna be difficult. Come on. Let's explore the rest of these uh, canals, see where they lead. Alright, I know what to do. Firebomb and sleep dart.
Oh, there's a guy. You are already dead. He doesn't see me. Haha. <laughs> I don't uh, complain. I don't know why, but I think it's so cool to uh, just randomly discover a completely new area that I missed. The, th the same thing might actually happen to me in Memphis when we get there, because uh, Memphis has a ton of secret entrances and underground tunnels and uh, uh, hidden passageways. Oh, I wanna... Can I jump to that uh, pole? I think I can. Ah, damn it! <laughs> That's so stupid. <laughs> Alright, I will... Uh, I will turn this quest in and... Um, I'll stream for a bit more, but I'll end the... Um, YouTube portion, the let's play when we turn this quest in. We got some cedar wood, that's good. Ah. Oh boy. What do I need to be able to upgrade now? Bronze and soft leather, actually. Okay, and pelts. And iron. And hard leather. <coughs> <coughs> Excuse me. Yeah, pelts and hard, hard leather I need for a tool pouch. I do want to upgrade that as soon as possible. I need more, uh, more of each tool. free for the Alexandrian poets to spread our revolution? I have dealt with all of Gennadios Velakitae, Thanos. Bayek, you are a poet of the kill! Fill the city with your words. I love you, Bayek of Siwa. You will be remembered more than any Magi in history. I have a new mount. And an ability point. Let's check out the mount. Passus, this sacred camel is so revered that legend has it, if killed, a war could break out in its honor. Sweet. And now let's get the bow bearer uh, ability. <coughs> Excuse me. And let's equip a second bow. So, uh, yeah, let's just go with this hunter bow. Alright, I will end the uh, YouTube portion here, so thanks for watching. Um, this uh, play, uh, this uh, installment we uh, 
uh, finished up in Alexandria, did all the side quests and um, and locations, and um, onwards to the Canopus Gnome. Thanks for watching, see you next time, bye bye.